I want to call five volunteers. Adam Ballam, Dr. Alan Baden, where are you? Where is Miriam Ballam? And where is Yechiel Sterin and Shaike Bloy and Mayor Promovich? Where are you all? Come here, Boina. <laughs> Stay next to your husband. These volunteers go out every single day to emergencies. I'm going to tell you about this couple, but I want to start with Shai Gebloi, lives in Masharim. He's a Toldos Aaron Chassid. And he goes out every day, Shabbos, Yom Kippur, to save lives. Baby. So I want to say thank you. These, these beautiful volunteers, I love them. Every one of them, I love them, but you know that the priority of volunteers, the secular volunteers, the Haredi volunteers, the non-Jewish volunteers, the men and women who volunteer, I love you all. Dr. Balin, you have a heart of gold with your wife, Miriam, and you always go out to cause. Whenever someone needs help, they're running out to help them. And you never ask for anything in return. But something you got in return, this yontif, I want to ask you, what happened? This yontif, while you were all sitting in the sukkahs, if it's in the citadel or your home or the Waldorf or the King David, you were sitting and eating in King David or you were in Chile. You were sitting there. What happened? This first day Yom Tov at lunchtime, we got a call that uh, no medic ever, we never want to get any calls, but a call that makes your blood run cold. And it's a call for an unconscious child. And Miriam had just gone upstairs to bring something to the sukkah. By the time she got downstairs, I was gone. And she had no idea where I went, but uh, we went to do our calling. We got to, uh, I was far away, I was the first doctor available. These guys were ahead of me. And thanks to him, we have a target of 90 seconds. In under 90 seconds, about 80 seconds, Shaika and his team were already on location. And unfortunately, it was our worst fears confirmed. We had the people there handed them. What did they find? The baby was. They handed them, they found someone had dragged a baby out of a fish pond in French Hill. And they were handed a baby that was blue, not breathing, with no pulse. And I, I didn't say this to the parents, but uh, he was, we had a clinically dead baby. Aged under two. The chances of saving a little kid like that are very, very low. The only way to save him is if you get there under two minutes with a defibrillator. That's why we have ambucycles. These guys came with ambucycles, came after. How does it feel like to see, you know, how many hours was your husband with them trying to help and the kid was unconscious and the kid is fighting for his life? How many hours were you there? Waiting at home, you didn't know where your husband, what it's going on. Yontif, you're eating in the sukkah alone. I could tell you exactly, because I was conscious of every minute going by while he was away. It was exactly five and a half hours. I want to call a little boy, two-year-old boy, by the name of Elchanan Aaron. Where are you, Elchanan? Boy. Hi, I'm Ellie Beer. You don't know me? One day I'll come, I'll get an ambucycle from you. <laughs> or maybe an ambulance. Where is Ima? Ima, I want to ask you a question. I never met you before. But I said the reason I wanted you up here to meet the volunteers who help and assist. Dr. Ballin was there with you in the hospital. And the other volunteers who came right away to help. This is a miracle. It's a, it's a big mitzvah to be, to have Pirsum and Nisa. It's a big mitzvah. But more importantly, two things are very, very important. How a nest happens and how volunteers leave everything they do and run to save. How was the experience that you had that second? I know you weren't prepared for this. 
Just give me in one sentence, how did you feel when you met the volunteers coming to you? Okay, when I met the, vo the volunteers, I basically, I, I ba saw the end, and I didn't really give it the chance, but they were battling on his life, and they brought his first breathing. And I really want to thank you for the, from the bottom of my heart for bringing my baby back and for being a very good shleichim. <laughs> we, Sadaka Tatsil Mimavis, Ain Sadaka Gadolim Izu, Mamish. Thank you guys, all of you. I just want to tell you something. This tonight, we saw miracles. We saw miracles. You know your son's going to be a Tzala volunteer one day with this energy. With this energy, I think I'm going to give him to be in charge of the water jets we have. 